get ready to coo, conserve and console in today's Showbiz Hot 5. Harrison Ford is swapping his whip for wildlife by supporting a new global initiative to save tigers from extinction. The Tiger Conservation Initiative will bring together wildlife experts, scientists, governments and now movie stars to try to stop the thriving illegal trade in the animals and to preserve their natural habitat. The Indiana Jones star, who's a long-time environmental activist, spoke about his desire to help at an event in Washington's National Zoo. Distinguished guests, I thank you for your commitment to tigers and to a healthy environment benefiting both the human and animal community. Thank you. But saving the world tiger population won't be an easy task, even with an action hero's support. Numbers have been declining from over 100,000 a century ago to less than 4,000 today. First it was Jessica Albert, now it's the turn of Tori Spelling to hear the showbiz patter of tiny feet. Yes, Tori's given birth to her first daughter, Stella Doreen McDermott. A rep for the former 90210 style confirmed the news to OK Magazine. Well, who else do you tell in Tinseltown? That she is, and I quote, here, she is a healthy baby girl and mum and baby are resting comfortably. Sticking with baby talk for a moment more because another famous mum will be enjoying sleepless nights on this side of the pond too. Orika Johnson has had her fourth child. She gave birth to baby Malcolm who weighed in at a pretty punchy 10 pounds. Comedy duo Alan Carr and Justin Lee Collins have signed on the dotted line to appear in Celebrity Wife Swap. The on-screen pair will swap showbiz lives with Katie Price and Peter Andre. The only problem is, Alan's now worried that Justin will refuse to hand Jordan back. Finally at number one, if music be the food of love, then play on. Yes, Sienna Miller's ex, Reese Iffens, is planning to get over his heartbreak by singing his heart out. The Notting Hill actor who briefly fronted indie group Super Fairy Animals back in the 90s is planning to pick up his mic once more and perform with a brand new band at this summer's Green Man Festival in South Wales. Now he should maybe think about getting someone else to do his publicity though, because he recently said, it's wild rock music and I do the singing. I play a little bit of guitar, but I'm not very good. I'm sold. <laughs>